Hello, my friends. My name is Giovanni. Um, <clears throat> I wanted to talk to you about the fight, the upcoming fight between um, Pacquiao and Bradley. Now, let me start by saying that that, <clears throat> that was a robbery, the first fight. They stole that fight from Manny. Uh, and I don't, you know, one thing that, that pisses me off is when you hear this fight. It's, I was listening to the interview, you know, face to face with Max Kellerman um, <clears throat> between Pacquiao and Bradley. And Pacquiao saying that, I mean, uh, Bradley said that he went back on the tape and he says he won eight out of twelve rounds. This guy, you know, and then, but you know, he's honest until it comes to telling the truth about who won the fight. You know, the fight with Ruslan, the Russian. That Russian beat the shit out of him. He almost knocked him out twice. He made him pee blood. This and he just put a whooping on him, and they gave Timothy Bradley that fight. You know what's it gonna take? They're gonna have to send this guy to the morgue. You know that's that's disgusting. You know that there are judges out there. You know, but it's it's. I guess they think it's the you know the bad judging is part of boxing, and it shouldn't be. You know, that's not true. Good, There are a bunch of good judges out there, but, you know, I don't have proof of it, but I bet anything, all these people are on the take, a lot of these judges. So, <clears throat> you know, I don't I don't care. They don't know anything about boxing. Uh, I mean, how can you give a fight to a guy who, who, who almost, I mean, who got beat to a pulp and almost got knocked out by somebody? Now, Bradley's saying, you know, don't get me wrong, I like Bradley until he started lying, until he lied about about uh, winning that fight 8-4 to four against Pacquiao. You know, why do you have to do that? Just be a man about it. If he's a man about everything else, why not be a man about the fact that, hey, man, I, you know, or at least say, hey, it was, uh, it was, uh, I'm not sure that I won. I, I, or just tell the truth, man. You know, why is it that people can't tell the truth? I don't give a shit. You're gonna, you're gonna get to fight him again. <laughs> now, Bradley, he, you know, he's a punches and bunches type of guy. He's fast and all that stuff, but he's not a, he's not as fast as, as Manny Pacquiao. Um, people think Manny Pacquiao's done. You guys are nuts. You think this guy, this guy just taken, he took on a, a on a full-blown welterweight and Brandon, Brandon Rios and, and, uh, and just took him to school. He wasn't even on the pedal. He, he never really... Uh, you know, put strength on the punches. He was just uh, using his speed and movement in and out, in and out, and that's it. You know, he boxed him and beat the shit out of him without uh, <clears throat> without getting into a brawl with the kid. Um, he flat out shamed them. But you know, these people think now that 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 uh, Pacquiao is just going to go and and try to kill this guy. First of all, I don't think he should do, he should do that. Okay, he should uh, move in there and box him like he did with Rios. Um, although Rios is a different fighter, um, and because he's more static, he likes to brawl in, in the middle of the ring um, or wherever he can. The, the kid is just a brawler, uh, but he he's not he he can deal with speed and angles like Manny's going to give him. Um, so basically, <clears throat> Manny needs to uh, be aggressive, but be be uh, be smart. Okay, when he's aggressive, um, I think he should be aggressive when he's inside, and not lunging in like he did with with uh, Marquez. And by the way, the Marquez fight, he was he almost he had Marquez almost out. He busted his face up. He was ready. To, he, that's what he wanted to do, finish him up. And uh, he got caught, and they think that because you get knocked out once, you know, you're 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 done. I don't know what they're talking about. I mean, it, Julio Cesar Chavez, when he started, when he started the big his big uh, name fights, he was he had 60 fights already, as far as the big name fights up north in the United States. This guy was had already fought monster Jose Luis Ramirez. Uh, you know, these guys are all monsters. So. Um, <clears throat> he had like a hundred some odd fights. Uh, Sugar Ray Robinson, he he had um, like a hundred fights. I'm not sure how many. Um, see, so and they all got knocked out. Like, Lamoda, 
knock this ass out if I'm not mistaken. Uh, you know, you know, I don't know what people think now that they, they're mistaken. I don't understand why they're trying to say that. Oh, if you lose, you're not a good fighter. If you if you lose, it means you're human and you have the balls to go in there and scrap it. You know, with the other guy, not with this pussy ass Mayweather style. That's you know in you know counter you know and, and puck shot and and put a boring fight and try not to get knocked out. You know, just to, to protect the the undefeated, not to fight. You know, they fighters who don't fight. You know, how is that? Isn't that a paradox or not, you moron? Um, so that's why. If boxing, it's not just UFC. If you ask me, UFC is boring, you know. Um, I like grappling and all that stuff, you know. But, uh, you know, they're just laying there sometimes and they have to stand them up and because they they're, they can't do anything. Uh, and sometimes they're the, 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 I mean, I, I, I just got turned off by the, by the injury to Anderson Silva, you know, that's gruesome. And people want, like to look at that shit. I don't like to see a man break his leg, for God's sake. That's fucking, that's, that's heartbreaking, you know. Um, <clears throat> but the thing is, I think what's going to happen is, is Manny Pacquiao is going to take this uh, Bradley and just bust him up and knock his ass out, probably. Um, because he's all tough and whatnot, but the reality is... That he's lost the fights with the two fighters that he that he, that were really tough on him. He lost the fight to Pacquiao. He lost the fight to the Russian, to Ruslan. Uh, I think it's Provodnikov. And it, it, here's a joke, you know. And this is when I when I start getting pissed off. Oh, I wanted to be like Mike Tyson, and I didn't use socks, and that's why I I messed up my ankles. And and you know he put on a show, taking taking his uh his uh his sneakers off and his boxing uh, shoes off and everything like he was in such pain and blah 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 man get the fuck out of here you know man up you know you walked in there like a grown man you know you didn't put socks on that's on you you know Mike Tyson never never uh, you know complain about not using socks or oh, I lost a, I lost a fight because I didn't wear socks you know, it's just to wish these people would man up, man, would man up and say, look, man, he, he, or, or or I couldn't knock him out because I, look, man, the guy beat you and they gave you the fight. That's it. You know, that was a robbery. You know, and I, one of these days, I will have so much fucking respect. I, I, that's why I don't have respect. You know, when they say, when they know that they stole the fight from them, one of these fighters should stand up and say, look, man, he beat me, but they gave me the fight. Why don't you have the balls to do that? Let's fight again so that I can beat him for real. You know, have the balls to do that. You know, and that's and then he wonder why he couldn't get a fight after after the Pacquiao fight. Of course you couldn't get a fight. Who the fuck's gonna fight you for what? You know, you don't have the balls to stay. It's people who don't understand. People they think boxing fans are stupid. We're not stupid. You know, we know who wins. We're gonna follow and we're gonna have the we're gonna have respect for those people who are honest. You know, but all of a sudden, these guys can, you know, a lot of guys out there can punch each other and can punch really hard and knock people out, but you can't tell the truth? Really? You know, so, I don't know. That's why people don't have respect for Mayweather. I never will have respect because he's a liar, man. He's, he's a liar, conniving, you know. That's why he can't get anybody to sponsor him. No one's going to sponsor Mayweather, ever. He had to get make his own brand. I don't know who the hell bites the money team apparel. I wouldn't. That's fucking a shame. A shame. You know, I don't want to wear attire that, that says, might as well say coward attire, you know, or chicken attire, chicken champ attire. I might as well say that because that's what the guy is. It's a chicken. He's been, he's been running from Manny Pacquiao for I don't know how long, you know. But, you know, that's what's going on in the boxing world today. Uh... There are there are very few honest people left, and uh, if they want to save boxing, they need to start telling the truth, especially the fighters. I don't care what their trainer says. I don't care what the promoters say. I don't care what the WBO, IBA, whatever, you know, like my nuts, whoever it is that you know, just yeah, association. Say to tell the truth. I lost the fight. Let's fight again. That was not fair. When you do that, you bring boxing back. Anyways, I think Manny's going to kick this guy's ass. Um, 
in once and for all. And 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 he he should call out Mayweather, call him out flat out, call him out, say look, and call him a pussy, and put down the Bible and all that shit. Put it aside and become a bad guy. You can you know ask forgiveness later and shit. You know, say but guys, ask permission from. From uh, what's his uh, his wife's name? Uh, Jinky, uh, the lady. Um, say, honey, I'm I'm gonna tell the kids not to watch the press conference because I'm gonna curse out a little. We're gonna get this fight, okay? We're gonna call out this pussy. You know, I'll help you out, okay, Manny. If you need help cursing, I'll help you out. Tell them you fucking pussy, and practice it. Practice saying that, Manny. You fucking pussy. <laughs> Anyways, Manny Pacquiao all the way, baby. From Puerto Rico, a lot of people love you, man. Take care.